in this code sample, we first uh, create an associative array. An associative array we are going to use when loading the image lib library. That associative array actually configures the library. So when I call, for example, the resize function or one of the other functions, I actually uh, perform some sort of a modification for an existing image. In this case, we refer this image, android.jpg, that exists in this uh, folder. In this case, the outcome will be a new image, a thumb image, because that's that's what I'm asking for. I'm looking for creating a thumb image, a small image. Um, so let's execute this code sample and see the outcome. Let's refresh and if we get back we check the folder we find in the same folder a new image the same name just with the underscore th thumb and that image is actually a thumb image, a small image created for this bigger one. 